Hey guys, welcome back. My name's Stu, and this is Scenario 1, Episode 5 of my Baron Desert playthrough. 10 roller coasters we need with an excitement greater than 6. So, in part 1, I built the wooden wild mine just here. In part 2, we built the junior coaster. Part 3, we built this mini coaster just here. And then part 4, we built this stand up twister just there. Now, one of the reasons for the excessive amount of loops just here was so that we can build a bit of uh, planning for the future in mind. So we could build, there's a couple of coasters. Um, we've got these two here. So the plan was to leave some loops there that we can use these to interact with, give us a nice boost. So, Without further ado, if I let's have a look. So if we, I want to get this through. No, let's go. Let's do the the back loop first. Me. Nope. I just want to get it. If I can line this up. Yeah. Okay, maybe to be easier if we do that. And the ground is 35, so let's take it down to 45. And we got the station one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, perfect. And then we can do that there. We can get the brakes ready. Probably going to be going slower than that. Um, or oh, actually. We won't ha need brakes. Do a little chain lift there. So at some point we'll probably finish on the water. Okay, so entrance, exit. So that's the motorbike. And then Steeple chase. So we're going to be doing two at the same time here. Entrance, exit, chain lift down. Okay, um, so let's do the path. No, I want to do, I wanted to leave a tile there so I can bring the other one over, but we're not going to have the room, so that's fine. We'll just do these like that. Um, I'll tell you what I will do. Right, you you can go away. Because I want to delete these. Let's do the ramps. get some no entry signs just on there stop people and some benches 
And whilst we're here, let's do the handyman. And I'd probably normally share a mechanic since they're so close to each other. But since we're not paying for them, since there's no money, they can have one each. Okay, so. Let's get them interacting. Drop down again. Um, let's do that. Um, nope, wrong spot. Okay, I've already, I'm too low. It's already gone through anyway, so we're going to get a nice boost. Um, so the red one is this side. So. It's hard to see with this green background. Um, okay, let's just let's just drop it down. Uh, I don't want to go underneath there. Um, By the time it gets back to there, it should be going fairly slow. Um, so now the orange one. Let's have a look. Let's get.
Um, so I'm going to want to get them roughly the same sort of uh, length. I think the orange one is going to be shorter. Um, I could always put a break on there somewhere to slow it down, or I can just extend it. So we've got both of them done. Let's give it a save. And then we can open them up. Eight on that one. Only six on that one. Okay. So there's a synchronization issue there. That's fine though. No. It just means that the one with the lower amount of cars will have to wait. It's not bad really. They come back to each other, uh, back to the stations relatively close together. So. Five point one two. Not great. And what was this one? Five point three two. Better. Again, not great. That's fine though, I think. Um by the time we do the synchronization and the paths, it should be fine. So let's there. Yeah, right, okay. It's locked on. Ah, there you go. That's better. Easy way to check is you can see the sign there, the closed. So just now it didn't have that. So that's why I knew that had messed up. Um, let's get. And it's going to do the same this side. Um, so I can see just below there's the arrow. So I can see the highlighted square. So I need to come back one and then this way. And then one in front of it. Okay, so let's toggle that. So it takes into account the paths. Um, So let's give them some names. So the horse, this one can be, um, since with the exception, I've got, so this was like a, a sort of a, a play on words, but everything else, 
parasite, toxoplasmosis, foot and mouth. They've all been quite sort of nasty. So let's, what about, uh, so for the horse, Costa, this can be the knacker's yard. So that can be Costa five. And the motorbike races, this one can be, I don't know. Bike crash. We got the stats back yet. No. Okay, that's fine. Let's just let's just get on with um let's just get on with doing some scenery. Not where I wanted to put it, but I'll take it. We're not paying for it, so it's fine. Um, let's get that under there. No. It's hard to see. Let's get that up there. The scenery will give us a nice boost of excitement. Get some under the pile in. Just we just want to get the uh, the bits that we can see. So I don't need to do it all. And we'll get rid of this. Okay, what are we doing now? Six point one, six point two one, five point nine two. We still haven't done the synchronization either. So we'll do leave if another train on both of them um let's do the fences Now, how about if we just do some walls? Again, just the bits that we can see. And then we can do something different here with the railings just to add a little bit of contrast.
paint that in there. I think that's pretty cool. So let's give it a toggle. Actually, we can put the speed all the way up on that and the speed on the horse. Yeah. A massive one mile per hour difference. So that will reset the stats. Cool. Let's open them up. Change this to 10 minutes. And 8.46. So I, that's probably taken a bit of a, had a bit of a boost. I think we can take this down to two trains. So we don't get uh, the ugly sight of one train waiting on the blocks. Now that it's um, no longer the newest coaster in the park, We've now got two newer ones, so it shouldn't be as busy. Lots of green and red hats around the place. Let's add some orange ones as well. Change the umbrella. What color is this one? Green. And this one, red. We'll change this one to green because it's kind of near this junior course. And this one, we'll change that to pink because it's kind of near that one. Delete that path there. Okay, so what have we got now? We've now got six coasters. Um, okay, so what? Seven can go there. Maybe eight over the water, depending on what unlocks. I have got an idea. Don't know if it'll work. How, how deep is the land? Hmm, I think it could be doable for a crazy coaster later on and then maybe one all the way around the outside as well check the stats 6.71 6.96 fantastic not a problem in the end the interactions with the loops worked great the scenery underneath the station and the pathing underneath the station worked great and of course the synchronization work great as well so this was what are we on now this was part five yes scenario one part five of the barren desert playthrough first scenario in the vj scenario pack full instructions on how to download that will be in the video description a link to that to the video um i'll also add a card i believe they call them on youtube um, so that'll be that thing in the top right hand corner um, with the playlist for this season, this scenario pack, this scenario. Yeah, this scenario, <laughs> this season of scenario. 
I don't know. It's really weird getting used to different episodes, all the same scenario. So I am Stu. I'm a little confused. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>